Hello and welcome back to the course on deep learning. Today we're talking about denoising autoencoders. Denoising autoencoders is another uh, regularization technique which is here to combat the problem of when we have more nodes in the hidden layer than in the input layer and therefore the autoencoder can simply just copy these values across without finding any meaningful features and undergoing the training that we wanted to undergo. And so what we're going to do here is we're going to take these input values and we're going to move them to the left and replace them with something else. And this something else is a modified version of our input values. So let's say we have input values x1, x2, x3, and x4. Well, what we're going to do is we're going to take these inputs and randomly out of them, we're going to turn some of them into zeros, just like that. And it's a parameter you can specify in your uh, in the setup of your autoencoder, it can be, for instance, half of your inputs that you have are turned into zeros every single time. And it happens randomly. So it's, uh, at every single uh, pass, it, will, it can be different variables. And then once you put this data through your autoencoder, what you do in the end is you compare the output not with the modified values, but with the original values. And that prevents the autoencoder from simply just copying those that... Uh, data or those inputs all the way through to the outputs because it's actually comparing the output not with the noisy but with the original inputs and that helps combat the problem that we are facing and also it's important to note here that as because this happens randomly this type of autoencoder is a stochastic autoencoder so basically it depends on this random generation or random selection of which values are going to be zeroed out and um, yeah, so it just becomes a stochastic type of autoencoder. Um, so there we go. That's how that's how the denoising autoencoders work. Also quite a popular technique. You will uh, hear about it and you will come across it if you're going to delve into the world of autoencoders. And in terms of additional reading, here is a, a great paper by Pascal Vincent and others, 2008. It's called Extracting and Composing Robust Features with Denoising Autoencoders. Exactly as you can see from the image exactly what we spoke about. Now make sure to check out these videos on the right or the full course in the description to continue your learning and I look forward to seeing you there.